Hello guys and welcome to another video from Leo Photo TV. My name is Frank. I am a photographer, videographer and creative director with Base in Mexico. Today we're going to be doing a comparison video between two of the latest offerings in tripod from Leo Photo. One of them is a mid-range and all-around tripod and the other one is a very lightweight and travel tripod. One is the LN-284CT tripod and ball head. This is a mid-range or all-around excellent tripod. The smaller one, or the travel tripod, is the LN254-CT tripod. This is a smaller and lightweight tripod. By no means, one tripod is better than the other one in quality. Both tripods offer you the same quality that Leo Photo is famous for. It is the same aircraft aluminum parts on both of them, and also the legs offers you the same 10 layers of strengthened carbon fiber that is making Leo Photo famous. The difference resides on the height and the weight of each of these tripod, also in the application that you're going to use it for. The idea of this video is to allow you for you to make a smart decision in which one is better for you. Or maybe at the end of this video, you're going to decide that you need both, one for everyday photography and the other one for travel. But rest assured that this tripod offers exactly the same quality as every other Leo Photo product. Let's take a look at each part of the LN-284 and also the LN-254 tripod. As I said before, both tripods are amazing. The LN-284CT is a great mid-range all-around tripod. It weighs only 1.8 kilograms, but it has a payload capacity of amazing 15 kilograms. The LN-254 is smaller and lighter. It weighs only 1.5 kilograms and it holds up to 10 kilograms. Both tripods offer four sections legs, all in 10 layers carbon fiber. The max height of the LN-284 is 1550 mm with the center column extended. And without the center column extended, it is 1250 mm, which is a really good range. Now, the LN-254 offers you 1500 mm in height already with the center column extended. And without the center column extended, you can go high up to 1214 mm. The folding length of the LN 284 is 567 mm, and the folded length of the LN 254 is 553 mm. These tripods are sold as a kit. Each model comes with its specific head. For example, the LN-284 comes with the amazing MB-40 head and the LN-254 comes with a pretty good head which is the MB-34. The difference between these two heads are not in the quality or the materials that they're used to build the head, it's only on the capacity of payload of this head. The head that comes with the LN-284CT it is the MB-40. It's a very similar head, but it loads more weight on it. It has a base diameter bigger, which is 51 mm. It has a payload capacity of 25 kilograms. This is 5 kilograms more than in the MB-34. 5 kilograms more is about 10 pounds more, and it weighs only 430 grams. Both tripods offers you the option for you to use it as a monopod. 
they do have a detachable leg. When you take it out, you can use it as a regular monopod, putting the head on top of them. The LN284 and the LN254 offers you the folded system. Basically, the center columns comes uh, extended and you just open the different legs. And by opening the legs and retracting the center column, now you have your tripod complete. If you will fold this or put this on a bag this size, it will take you about seven centimeters more than when it is folded. So the same goes for the LN-284. Same system, you just fold the legs, unfold the legs, and you lose and retract your center column. Another feature that is equal for both tripod is that the center column can be turned around. So basically you can detach the center column and put it upside down, thus giving you a really low ground for you to take your picture if you need to. A great option that I really love about this tripod and is equal for both of them is that you can take the center column out and use it without the center column. This allows you for you to have a tripod that is really solid because you are not counting on the center column going up or down. Now, make sure that you understand that when you take the center column out of the tripod, your maximum height is going to be reduced on both of the models. And another feature that is exactly the same between both tripods are the angles that you can position the legs. Each of these tripods, you can use the angle of the legs on 55 degree, 85 degree, and 25 degree. The widest one being 25 degree and the tightest one being 85 degree. This is a really, really good option when you're doing different position or in different locations, when you need the legs to be on different places. Both tripods offers you the option for you to replace the feet. They come standard with rubber feet, but Leo Photo supplies you spikes which are really good when you are in gravel or in, in a place where there has a lot of rocks or when you just want to secure your tripod to the ground. Another feature that I really love about this tripod that is the same for both of them is how you give maintenance to your legs. Basically what you do is that you just unscrew either one of the, of the leg sections and now you have that section completely out. Now you can clean the inside of the legs and also the groove of the thread which is amazing. Some other brands, they have those little patches on the side. I really don't like that because almost every time I try to clean those tripods, those things got lost and I have to buy a new one. Maybe it's just me, but I really love this because it's very simple. To put it back, do the same, screw it, and now you have it. You just lose it once and you got your extension legs out. I love it. Really easy to use, very easy to maintain and to clean. Now, the main difference between these two style or these two models of tripod comes on the diameter of the legs. On both models, the legs are 10 layers carbon fiber reinforced, which gives you a really good stability and quality but the diameter of the legs are different. For example, on the LN-254, which is the smaller and lighter tripod, the diameter of the bigger leg is 25 mm, and the diameter of the smaller or thinner, thinner leg is 16 mm. When you compare that to the LN-284, there is a pretty big difference. The diameter of the thicker legs is 3 mm more, is 28 mm and the diameter of the thinner is 19 mm, another 3 mm more. This, it turns to be more stability for you and also a greater capacity tripod. That is the main difference between these two tripods. Okay guys, now that you have seen the main difference between each of these tripods, it is up to you to decide which one is better for you. The LN-284 combined with the MB-40 head is a perfect all-around tripod. 
It's a tripod that is light even to travel with it, and it's a perfect tripod for location work and for the studio. It holds 20 kilograms, and that is a lot, and it goes really high. Now, if you are like me, that sometimes you, need, you really need to travel really, really light, sometimes on a one day trip that in the morning you go, you take your pictures with your customer, and at night you come back and you're only using a backpack with your equipment, the LN-254 together with the MB-34 head is the perfect companion. You also have to take in consideration your main work, what you do the most, and that will allow you for you to take the best decision. Guys, if you have any question or you are not sure which one is better for you of the complete range of tripod from Leo Photo, send us an email or just send us a message here in the social networks and we're going to help you to take the best decision. But remember, making a smart decision will save you money in the long run. Thank you so much for watching this video and thank you for visiting Leo Photo TV. My name is Frank. Until next time, see you later.